If you're on the market for a new phablet, but don't want to spend the small fortune required to get a Galaxy Note 8 or iPhone X, then the Huawei Mate 10 Pro may well be your next phone. The Mate 10 Pro is the only phablet the company is currently selling in the UK, with Huawei having chosen not to range its slightly more affordable, regular Huawei Mate 10. The Pro offers fantastic hardware, with highlights including the mobile HDR ready OLED screen, super fast CPU, more memory than you can shake a stick at, and excellent battery life. This plus it's wallet friendly, relatively speaking, £699 price tag make it a compelling choice for any fan of big screen phones. My only minor quibble is that the Mate 10 Pro's AMU Android skin still comes with a load of annoying, niggling flaws. The Huawei Mate 10 Pro has a close to identical design to the regular Mate 10, which is no bad thing. The design takes the same mixed metal and glass approach as the Galaxy Note 8 or iPhone X. The slightly curved glass back, coupled with the sturdy metal sides and near bezel less front, makes the Pro one of the prettiest fibulets on the market. The slim bezel also means the Pro doesn't feel terribly unwieldy, despite packing a 6 inch screen. The big difference between the Mate 10 Pro and the regular Mate 10 is that the Pro has an OLED, not LCD, screen. Specifically the Pro comes with a 6-inch HD plus HDR10 OLED display, while the regular Mate 10 comes with a more basic 5.8-inch Quad HD HDR10 LCD screen. Some people may complain about the seemingly lower resolution, but the truth is that the Pro's 2160 by 1080 pixel count is more than good enough. Even if you try your absolute hardest you're not going to spot individual pixels. Huawei has always struggled with mobile software, thanks to its insistence on using its own Amri skin. Traditionally this has warped whatever Android version it's laid over to near unrecognizable levels, making needles UI changes and adding more third-party bloat away or in duplicate apps than could easily be counted. Despite coming on leaps and bounds, and Huawei having managed to load the Pro with the Google's latest Android 8 Torio software, this problem remains the same on the Mate 10 Pro. Emotion UI still completely reworks key things, like Android settings menu, making it difficult to find the exact option you're looking for. It also removes the app tray from the main menu. Despite a radically reduced amount of bloat wear, you'll also still find pointless duplicate applications for things like music, calendar and messaging that offer at best equivalent features to Android's native apps.